to another video my name is Shapita and if you're new to my channel welcome welcome on today's video we will be doing a Valentine's Day slash date night outfit inspiration so all of these outfits are outfits that are my recommendation for date night or Valentine's Day so as a disclaimer I do want to say if you hear any noise right about now I have my kids in two separate rooms right now because they want to watch two separate things so you may hear Micah over here and Amira over there but just take all mistakes for love and yeah let's get started this is not one of the date night outfits um, I had this on for today okay so this is not one of the date night outfits however if you follow me on instagram i took a picture in this outfit and i actually was on a date with my husband that day so i guess if you're feeling you know very laid back and it's not really that serious you know then feel free to wear this is okay so the first outfit is this cute little real big and poofy top i like to say it's like one of the back in the day i want is it roman i think it's like the rome type of inspired shirts where it has like the bell long wide sleeves and it's just really flowy it's off the sleeve and I did get it a little too big, but if you wanted to take it in, you could definitely do like a belt and belt it in that way that you can cinch your waist. And I paired these with some black high-rise high skinny leg jeans from Forever 21. So I just decided to pair these two together and all items will be listed on the description box below. But you guys, it is very flowy. I love the sleeves. Um, it does, it does like take in and ruffle in certain spots. So it makes it very flirtatious, very cute, very just angelic, like honey. I am wifey material. Yes, love me. Get on one knee. I am. I'm ready, boo. Can't you see? Can't you? Can't you see? Can't you see? That's what this top say. Like, marry me. I'm angelic. I represent the angels in heaven. Marry me. <laughs> no, but for real, though, and speaking of side story, like, Valentine's Day has always been special to me because 10 years ago, on Valentine's Day, my hubby had proposed to me and everything. So, y'all, you know, you got to make sure you dress. And I really was not dressed how I wanted to be. Had I known he was going to propose, I probably would have dressed a whole lot better on that day. But he proposed to me on Valentine's Day, and I just thought that was so cute. So, girl, if you get just a little inkling, just dress up for the hell of it so you could be like cute and irritating. But this is cute. This comes from damn, Forever 21. This shirt comes from Forever 21. And I just love it. Like I said, if you want it to be taken in some more, then just put a cute little belt on it. I like the ones that kind of like wrap around your waist and they're real wide. If I can find a picture, I'll um, link it somewhere on a video, wherever. But yeah, that is this outfit, all cute and flirty and you're comfortable so you can eat. You know what I'm saying? And I feel guilty like you're going to have a little belly or like he can't even see it. 
And you can also wear your lingerie up on this, this, so you know you can surprise her. You like, oh, she's so pretty, she's so classy, she's so angelic, and then you know, start you know, doing your little thing, you know, your little thing. And but that's your business. I don't judge. This is a judge-free zone. You do what you want. I ain't gonna tell yo. Your secret is safe with me. Okay? Just think of me as the pages in your diary. Okay. Okay, so this is the next outfit idea for Valentine's Day or date night. This is a nice acid wash half jacket. It stops literally right at the waist. Pair with this nice t-shirt. It has like a little knot in detail right here with kind of like folds inside and out. So it goes like short right here. It pulls on the material here. And then it goes down to regular length, which is like hip length this way. Pat with the same high rise from Fashion Nova. So this is another very cute laid back date outfit that you can wear going on a day. It's very chill. You're not trying too hard. If you're a girl who loves heels, you can pair these with some cute booties and a nice little handbag. Um, or you can do a crossbody if you wanted to. I probably would be, I love the bags that go off of the arm, that fall off the arm. I love those type of bags, so I would probably do like a bag like that. Or you can even do a clutch if you want to make it real classy. You can throw on some leopard print shoes with this. Rather it's sandals, flats, heels, boots, or booties. So any of those things would be cute if you want to be basic but still like nice, clean, and trendy. You could lose the jacket, do your cute little layered necklace or a statement necklace or you could do statement earrings you could play with simple outfits like this as much as you want you could pair it with a cute black blazer or whatever blazer you want to pair with this and really make it nice and classy and date night or date date appropriate so this is this outfit And if you guys would like a style of, I'm sorry, a size reference in pants, I am a size 26. And tops, I usually wear like a 22, 24, or like a 2X. And then pants, I'm usually in a 3X, 4X. Okay, so next outfit is this cute leopard print dress that I got off of the pants rack at Walmart. Literally, this dress was by dollars y'all five dollars and it's a full wrap dress it's not like a real wrap dress but it just gives it an illusion of one and it ties right here on the side i can't remember if i've um wore this in a previous clothing haul if i did i'll make sure i link it in the description box below if i did but i don't remember so don't quote me but I do like this one. This one is very flirtatious. It's flowy, but yet classy in a way. It stops a quarter of the way down the leg. And as you can see, I can do this and it's not going to show anything. So yeah, that's what makes it like a full wrap dress. But this is really cute. It stops a little right above the elbow. And you can play with this all sorts of ways. You can do clear or nude heels. You can do black heels. You can do a cute sandal, like a dressy sandal. Um, I really wouldn't like flats with this, not unless those are your backup shoes. But I wouldn't pair it with flats. But like a cute heel, a heel will definitely take this dress another notch with a cute red lip and then just a very basic um, soft glam makeup look because when I go on dates I try to go very soft sometimes a lot of times no eyeshadow just make sure that my skin looks nice and glowy and 
because you know it's just you and him and you want the attention to kind of be on you and your natural beauties and stuff so yeah i thought this would be really cute and then if you get cold because we all know the movie theater get cold we all know that the restaurants get cold so i would just wear this little faux leather jacket that I got from Roses and I would just take it with me. That way I won't get too cold. And it kind of tones it down a little bit if you're not really going dressy dressy. But yeah, I would take this cute little jacket and you can bring you like a metallic clutch. I would wear a clutch with this. Um, not a handbag, not a crossbody, but I, me personally would do a clutch with a outfit like this very basic accessories like a single necklace and maybe like a thin bracelet and then like either some studs or some small hoops like what I have on so because the dress is doing the talking because it has the leopard print and I absolutely love leopard print so I would just like to let the dress do the talking for this so yeah that is this outfit. And it'll also be cute for expecting mothers too. You'll be totally hot. You'll be a hot mother. To be honest, the only reason why I thought about that because I was thinking, man, I look a little pregnant in this dress. So that made me think, oh, this would be cute for mothers. Yeah. Don't mind me. Okay, so next outfit is this cute body cut. Well, it's not really body cut material, but I say body cut because body cut is usually known to really you know grab your body and show every hip dip lump or whatever but this would be a number that you would want to wear good shapewear with i'm just wearing like my soft hold shapewear if you will like the one that i feel comfortable with wearing every day but i would do like a uh waist center with this that way it'll kind of like tuck in my stomach a little bit more but this is a cute dress that i got actually for christmas from my auntie she loved me her auntie but i thought this was like really super cute at first i thought it was a shirt but then when i saw it, it went down i was like oh she don't mess up she don't mess up and this kind of like mocks the versace shirt that I featured in one of my other videos, one of my other clothing hauls. So this material kind of mimics that a little bit. You can wear it off the shoulders, make it look a little bit more flirty, or you could just wear it like how I had it and kind of let it drape in the front. If you got like some nice melons, this dress also would look real bomb on you because like your Chi Chi sitting up and they sitting pretty, and he like, whoa. Can't you tell I want big titties so bad? But I ain't got none, but it's all right. It's all right. I make up for the back, as you can see. But this outfit is very super cute, and it goes at a slant at the bottom. Don't mind my shape we're peeking through, but it goes at a slant like it's shorter on this side, than it is on this side. And of course, you got to wear it with heels. You absolutely have to step out in some heels when you're wearing a dress like this. The, sweet, the sleeves stop almost to the wrist, but not quite. And it's very light, it's very comfortable. It is very, very, very stretchy. This is a 3X and it marks the Versace print. And I just love everything about this dress. It's nice and it's classy. It's not really hoochie mama, although if you like that style, I ain't judging. But this is very cute. And I will also pair that full leather jacket that I wore with the last dress that I just showed you. I will also bring that with me to kind of cover up. I wouldn't do a jean jacket with this. Or a nice little blazer would be cute. Or something like that. Just to keep with you in case if you get cold or it, it might be still winter where some of you are i'm in florida so we kind of go back and forth but you can do something like that i would do a layered necklace piece 
or a nice little single chunky chain necklace and bracelet and like some smaller earrings like uh some studs some very like classy statement piece studs that can really set this outfit off and take it another level so i like this piece this is this one i'm not exactly sure where she got it from if i find out i will link it in the description box below okay so next number is this cute also very basic but very classy outfit you see the running theme excuse my son he's so disrespectful Gosh. As you can see, the running theme for this video is very, like, cute and plain and classy, you know, because you don't really have to try too hard, sis. He already love you. You already got it in the bag, you know? So now you just got to, you know, be classy with it. Just let him absorb all that beautifulness, okay? So this is a cute little outfit. I paired this shirt. I got it from... I want to say Ross. How Ross, they had like the clearance section, because you know I'm cheap. Had with this skirt that I got from Fashion Nova, very tight. I want to say, is it considered A line? I think it's kind of like A line. And as you can see, it's very cute. Had with a cute jacket. Um, I've been into those jean jackets that kind of look like a blazer in a way those would be that type of jacket would be very cute with this outfit so you compare that with this you can even go even classier and more chic and trendy with the white blazer that will really set this off with some like clear and nude heels i always talk about clear nude shoe heels and i don't think i own not one pair but you know what I mean, like, because with clear and nude, clear, well, their shoes, and they're literally clear and nude. That's the color of the shoe. And they have them in all sorts of different styles of heels. And it literally goes with everything. So I would love to own me a cute little pair because it goes with just about every outfit that you can think of. And it will just take it up to the next level. So you can pair that with it if you want to do a white blazer roll up the sleeve for it to go halfway up the arm and you can do that type of jacket so you can play with this all sorts of ways you can do a half jacket anything your heart's desire but i'm just showing you like the base pieces for a date night outfit idea so this is this outfit Okay, so this is the last outfit, and it is, we're going back to the basics, where it's this cute, very faded, army fatigue print shirt, and I like it because it kind of looked like the colors done washed away a little bit, and I've been into that style, like that whole distressed print type of style, and this is very basic. If y'all going out, you can wear some cute sandals. You can wear some heels with this. I pair with some basic jeans that I got from Walmart about two years ago. And this shirt also comes from Ross. And you can style this all sorts of ways. You can do like a very long necklace, some cute little dangly earrings, layer up some bracelets, some, you know, a cute little ring. And look, very cute and sophisticated, but very simple and classy. So I don't really have too much to say about this because the outfit pretty much speaks for itself. And for all my basic babes where, you know, you don't like to do too much, but you still want to look good. This is what this outfit gives you. And, you know, you just do your makeup. So that pretty much puts a close to this video. I thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, again, welcome, welcome. My name is Shaquita, Beauty by Beauty with Quee on Quee TV. And I will talk to you later on our next video. Bye.